Hello everyone. Welcome to this uh, C programming term work series on VTU prescribed lab term works. In the previous video, I have covered the term work one. In this video, we will uh, go through with the term work two. So what is the uh, problem definition for the term work two? That is, we need to write a C program to convert kilometers into meters and centimeters so there will be a data given from the user we have to take a input from the user in the form of kilometer we have to convert it into the meters and centimeters using appropriate formulas and display the result to the display the result as a output to the user so So this is the conversion formula for the uh, kilometers to meters and centimeters. So we all know that one kilometer is equal to 1000 meters. So to get you know, the meters from the uh, kilometer, we, what we need to do is we have to multiply 1000 by the input kilometers so that we will be getting a meters. For example, if the kilometers is two, then two into 1000 will be 2000. So 2000 meters will be the possible meters from the given input that is two kilometers. Once we get the meters by multiplying the kilomet kilometers with thousand, the next step is to get centimeter. Instead of uh, using the kilometers and multiplying it with the big number we already got the meters what we can do is we know that uh, one meter is consisting of 100 centimeter so get this meter multiply it with the 100 you will be uh, having the centimeter answer so this is how the unit conversion works and this is the logic we are going to use in our program let us uh, talk about some sample input output say the first uh, input sample input we have is uh, five kilometer what is the expected output for that five thousand meters because five in two thousand is five thousand which is five thousand meters and uh, the five thousand meters should be multiplied by hundred so that we can get 5 lakh as the centimeter for the given input 5 kilometer. Similar way we have another input say 13 and um, um, we are uh, multiplying it with 1000 to get meters as 13,000 and 13 lakh when we multiply this meter with the 100. So this is the simple program to do the uh, task we already discussed so instead of uh, doing it over here what i will do is i will uh, explain the same program in the programming id so we will uh, write the program and i will explain uh, what all the uh, logic we are using in the program while writing the code. First, we will begin with the preprocessor directive that is hash include to include the header file stdio.h. After that, I am having a main function. Main function is the entry point of program execution. In the main function, I need to have uh, three variables one for holding kilometer, one for holding meter, one for holding centimeter. So I will say double, why double, why not int, why not float is, the double gives us more precision than the float variable. We are not get, uh, taking integer variables because integer variables cannot hold the rational numbers or floating point numbers. So we are using uh, double double kilometers then i will have double meters 
डबल सेंटीमीटर वंस वी हैव थ्री वेरिएबल्स डिक्लेयर्ड वी कैन से द यूजर वी कैन प्रॉम्प्ट द यूजर टू एंटर द किलोमीटर्स वी विल से एंटर द डिस्टेंस because the whatever we are doing we are doing it for calculating the distance between two points enter the distance in kilometers and i will uh, use the scan f to read so remember in the scan f function we need to specify the control string inside the control string we need to specify the format specifier here the format specifier is percentage lf L, lf stands for double because we are reading double data we are storing it back in the uh, kilometer because first we are initially reading the kilometers from the user the simple conversion which i told that is meters equal to kilometers into thousand the same expression i am writing it in terms of a c programming language meters equal to kilometers multiplied by 1000 how to get centimeters from it we can directly get it get it from kilometers also but we will use meters for simplicity because meters into 100 is easy to remember and easy to write because 1 centi 1 meter is always equal to 100 cm we are using the same logic in the form of c language now once we get the result stored in these variable the next job is to print them in the form of the distance in meters is percentage lf again for indicating the Uh, long, sorry, double variables. Then we will have a new line operator also, so that the next output should come on new line. I am having a meters again a printf. I am again having a. Uh, I am again have to display the distance in the form of a centimeter. in the first statement i have displayed distance in the form of uh, meters now i am displaying it in the form of centimeters again i will have a new line character then i will display the centimeters what here i am doing in the printf statement is i am having a text the distance in meters is followed by that i am having a format specifier which data i am printing i am printing double data so i am having a percentage lf specified for double where to get that double data after the control string i am having a variable specified meters is the variable uh, which is in the form of double so this the value of meters will be printed inside this string as a output same thing we did for centimeters also ending with semicolon and this does our job we are ending it with return zero let us execute and see i will be using the visual studio code as a programming id you can use any of your preferred id no issues with that enter the distance in kilometer i will say 12.5 so the distance in meters is 12500 and distance in centimeters is uh, i think it is 12 lakh 50000 we are getting here a series of zeros what if i want to Uh, reduce it to only two zeros after the decimal. I can specify it using a format specifier only. That is percentage dot two lf. It specifies that 
dot to specify that after this dot after this decimal point have only two places i will here also have the same let us execute again and now enter the input of 4.5 you can see we are getting 4500 meters with the two zeros after the decimal point so i hope you have got the logic and uh, how to solve the problem thank you